that we are in church and the worship and praise is going on. I just see you, you are raising your hand and you are crying. And I know it is not the Holy Spirit. You know, I see the Holy Spirit. You know, and I know when the Holy Spirit is upon somebody. You are not inside the Holy Spirit. You are out of the Holy Spirit. What is wrong, my child? Pastor, for the last three years, it has been agony in my household with my husband. Hold on. So, uh, so you are saying that agony is inside your house with your husband? No, Pastor. Pain, Pastor. Oh, oh, oh pain. Okay. <laughs> forgive, my, forgive my intellectual. Hey! <laughs> uh, so, what happened to your husband? Pastor, he's so disrespectful. He doesn't give me any money. He doesn't eat my food. He's very abusive verbally and his mother is so disrespectful. Hold on, hold on. He, he doesn't give you any money? No, Pastor. As a husband? Yes. He, he is very disrespectful? He is. You know, you know, Sister Peru, this is what I teach people in the marriage class. I tell them that whenever you are in a marriage and your husband is behaving like that, left him. Will you keep quiet? Very hard to do. It's been a while we've been married and it's hard to walk away from somebody that you love. Sister Peru? You are not only going to walk away, you are going to run away. Sister Peru, do you know how to run? Yes, Pastor. You know how to run? Yes. Show me your leg, show me your leg. Let me see the leg that you use to run. Good, good. Sister Peru, you are not going to die in that marriage. Amen. You are not going to die in that marriage. Hallelujah. Sister Peru? Yes, Pastor. In Jesus we can die. In Jesus we can die. In Jesus. He can die. In Sister Peru, come and show me where your husband is. Yes, because I'm very fed up. I'm really, really fed up. You are very fed up. Does he come in there, Pastor? That is your husband? Yes. Sister Peru, do you know how to fight? Yes. Do you have Sandy number? Yes, Pastor. All right, good. You deal with him. Call Sandy and tell Sandy that he has a customer coming in. If I don't kill him, yes. Mr. Peru, okay. stop right there. Stop right there. I said stop right there. Eh? The son of the Holy Ghost, your pastor, and, and the pastor of your wife is telling you to stop, and, and you are here, and you are looking at me like a locomotive muscle. So stop right there. Eh? Today, you are going to release my child alone. Stop right there. How you doing? You all right? <laughs> yeah, you look, you look so well, well fed. Uh, yeah. So we wanted to tell you that Jesus is coming soon. Sister Peru, come here. Sister Peru, come. Come, come. Why didn't you tell me that your husband is as big as a buffalo? I'm oh, so sorry. Oh, sorry. S Sister Peru, do you know what you put me into? Sister Peru, have you called Sandy? Yes, okay, tell Sandy that I am the customer that is coming. <sighs> the Lord is with me, eh? <sighs> All right. <clears throat> hey, we are here, right? And I am her pastor. And I want to let you know that he that is in me is greater than you that is in me. Yes, you. Sorry, um, he, he, he that is in me is greater than... How, how do they say it? He, he Losing that, thoughts, eh? Eh? No, 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 I'm not, I'm not losing thought. This is my, my child. She comes to my church. That is my wife. Yeah, yeah, she's your wife. And, and why do you have to be treating her like that? Eh? She, she came to me and she said that you are very disrespectful, that you, that you don't give her money. Uh, she said that your mother disrespects her. And she said that you snore like a bulldog at night. That when you snore, like you wake up the whole neighborhood. Even down to the no whole neighborhood are complaining that you snore too much. Peru, me snoring? Yes. She just made it up. No, 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 she can't, she can't make it up. Look at your size. With this thing that you have, like you have enough air. Yes, Pastor. Everything that you have, you will just be releasing it, releasing it. Why won't you snow? Hmm. Huh? Pastor, I don't snow. She just made it up. You don't no. snow? 
And besides, she tell you she can't cook? This girl don't know to cook? No, 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 no. You said that she can't cook? She can't cook. Sister Pippi, you can't cook? Sister Pippi, when was the last time that uh, she cooked for you? I can't resist by my mother all the time. And because my mother cooked for me, she said my mother disrespectful. She cannot cook. I thought she know for cook. If I didn't know she didn't know for cook, I didn't marry her, she. Sister Peru? Sister Peru? So you finally gone dumb? Huh? Sister Peru? So you... Pastor is not all. Wait. Plus, every time this girl will come home and lie down, and I try to touch her, I can't touch her. Hold Everything she does lock up tight tight like she going to Ukraine, Afghanistan or war in Russia. She Everything covered down. She just lock up everywhere. Everything she lock up. So so you you have not you have not done a husband and wife thing for, for three years past I can't touch it. Jesus is lost. Three years. Three years past though. You're a man. You're a man. Hold it up. Hold it up. Three years. Three years. So three years. And your husband have not touched your Adam apple. Huh? So why are you married? Pastor, she ever tell you who she best friend? Best friend? Ask you who she best friend, man. Ah, she best friend is male. Male best friend? Ask you who she best friend. Ask she. My church, Piru. Piru? You have male best friend. Piru, you are married and you have male best friend. Piru? Pastor. Who is your best friend? Um. Um. Tell me who is your pastor. That's Pastor's right. Jesu! Roy! See out our person, Roy. <laughs> pastor Roy. You are the one lying. Sister Peru? Give me my Bible. Give me my Bible. Huh? And you are even holding the word of God that is written in in um Levic 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 Leviticus. Le Don't correct me! Don't correct me! I, I I am the one that will be correcting you. You 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 almost killed me today. Sorry, sir. I, I, um it was her fault, right? Uh, uh, she wanted to set me up. <laughs> so you got tell me about the church you keep every night? Uh, which church? Every night she's got church, whole night prayer meeting coming home in the morning. Brother, our church is in the morning time. We never have no night church. Period of yourself for yourself. I... I was. You thought Rasta? I thought you were a Christian. I what? Uh... You're not talking now. Okay. Thank you very much, yeah? And um, so, um, actually, I was going towards this way, home, right? But I just changed my mind. Since you are going towards this way, I will go with you. Eh? <laughs> so, give me a drop, eh? It's not like I'm begging, but it's just that. <laughs> so, you're then talking about Sandy on the screen. So, no. you could drop it by Sandy. Mm -mm. No, no, no. Who wants to go by Sandy? No, no. I, I, you know, I, I, I just hear about Sandy. So, I was just talking about him. I want to go home, like home, not not oh. home, not home to Sandy. All right. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. I drop. Uh, you, you walk home. Mm -hmm. you, you wanted to kill me. You wanted to kill me. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. You will not kill me before my time. You will not kill me. Thank you very much, Pastor. <laughs> Thank you for saving me. Thank you, my Lord. Thank you for saving me. Thank you. This woman. She wanted to kill me before my time, you know? I like you all the time, you know? I, I was the one that told her to marry you. <laughs>